So I'm not a great binger, to be honest. Oh, good luck to everybody watching this show, because I don't know how y'all are going to do it. People with perfect lives don't usually jump off of ferries. Day of the accident. Your husband's alibi is a lie. This isn't the first time Oliver Jackson Cohen has played the abusive husband. Oliver was the invisible man driving Elizabeth Moss mad in the 2020 thriller. Did that role have anything to do with casting him in Surface? <laughs> I feel like I'm destined to always play people that try and kill their wives. Um, uh, I, I think it's actually kind of a genius move from Hello Sunshine and Apple, really, that, that people will probably come into this expecting something. But as we as the show goes on with with a show like this, nothing is ever the way it seems and then you think you've got the hang of it and then it flips on its head and then there's another twist and then another twist and it just keeps on flipping around so it's like a, it's a real roller coaster of uh, constant shifting and changing that, that goes on uh, that's incredibly stressful but very very satisfying to watch. Well, it's so funny because when you meet Oliver, he is just the funniest, goofiest, kind of nerdy, warm guy you could ever meet. And then when he gets on screen, he is immediately this dangerous, sexy, intense guy. So it's one of the bigger dichotomies between who he is in real life and who we see on screen. But seeing that charm that he has, like the, one of the first times I met him, he did that little shoulder dance that was just so disarming and adorable. And we were like, we have to put that in the pilot because you never know what to make of James. You know, is he this person who's a threat or are they star-crossed lovers? And that's a question that it takes Sophie at least the season to answer. Gugu and Oliver's co-star Stephen James plays the third wheel in Surface. Steven describes what it was like watching star and producer Gugu in action as the lead and as his boss. You know, they, they, the two kind of came with each other. And so um, she was very collaborative, um, very thoughtful um, about every moment, um, you know, inclusive of, of myself and Ollie and the rest of the cast and hearing our opinions and our thoughts, um, you know, based on any, any given scene. Um, so yeah, I mean, I really, really admired just, just watching her from a distance, being able to experience not only the work she was doing as an actress, but uh, you know, her, her producerial work as well. It will drive viewers crazy waiting for new episodes to drop to get answers. Are the actors patient viewers or do they prefer binge watching? Oh, <laughs> it depends on the material, I have to say. I mean, I think the cool thing about this, um, you know, is that all three episodes are going to come out on the 29th of July. So hopefully that'll be enough to get everybody hooked. Uh, and then you will have to wait a week, you know, um, for the rest of the season. But, you know, um, I don't know. I think there's something about a thriller and, you know, every episode of this, there's new information, there's a twist, there's a turn. So hopefully that'll keep people, you know, desperate for the next one. And if not, and if they watch it later, then, you know, it'll be all there to be able to be binged as well. So, um, so yeah, but myself, I... I go through phases. I'm not a great binger, to be honest. I like sort of pacing things out, but um, maybe I'm alone there. Yeah. No, I'm with you on that. <laughs> yeah. I actually love watching one episode a week, but I think what's great about how Apple is launching this show is that the first three episodes will be all available at the same time. And that's really like the first act of the movie of this series. You know, if you think of this as an eight hour film, Act one sets up the whole journey and leads Sophie basically to an edge of a cliff. You know, is she going to jump off and go on this journey? And are we going with her? That's where we're left after these first three episodes. I'm not. I'm not patient at all. Good luck to everybody watching this show because I don't know how y'all are going to do it. If it was me, I'd wait till they all come out and then just binge it back to back to back. But I understand that not everyone has that willpower. So to each his own. <laughs>